Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Most Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost, I adore thee profoundly. I offer thee the most precious body and blood, soul and divinity of Jesus Christ present in all the tabernacles of the world in reparation for the outrages, sacrileges, and indifferences by which he is offended. And through the infinite merits of his most sacred heart and of the immaculate heart of Mary, I beg of thee the conversion of poor sinners. Amen. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love thee. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love thee. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love thee. I beg pardon for those who do not believe, do not adore, do not hope, and do not love thee. Sancti Michael Arcangeli, defende nos in prerio, contra nequitiam et insilias diaboli esto presidium. Imperatri Deus, supices te precamor, tuque princeps militiae celestis, Satana maniosque spiritus malignos, quel perdizione manimarum prevagantur in mundo, divina virtute infernum retrude. Amen. Our Lady of the Rosary, pray for us. As we enter into these glorious mysteries, we pray for the repose of the souls of all those who have passed from this world in the last 24 hours, and especially for the souls of the 19 children and of the two teachers who were killed so tragically in Texas, that the Lord might grant eternal rest to their souls, and especially that the, well, above all for that, for eternal rest for their souls, for consolation for their families, and for the protection of innocent life at any stage, that God might grant conversion to all those tempted to take innocent lives. And for those from throughout the world who are suffering tragically in situations that are much less publicized, for those in Kenya, including those praying with us from Kenya, uh, who confided private intentions, so I'll pray with you, for you. Also for those praying with us from Slovenia and from so many other countries around the world, that God might grant your countries and the people suffering there the most his consolation, his strength, and his courage. And then uh, a beautiful prayer intention from Emanuela, who's in eighth grade of Holy Trinity School in California. Emanuela prays for 21 students, her classmates, I presume, 21 students who either yesterday or today are consecrating themselves to the Immaculate Heart of Mary. And she talks about a number of their children not having been, you know, that, well, I'll just say, Emanuela, I will pray for all the students and for the special request you intended, that you confided, especially that you might be guided by your good Heavenly Mother and that all of you might grow in holiness. For Stephanie and your nursing exam coming up in just a few days and for all the ways that you can then care for your family. For all those who are sick, especially those who might be called from this world soon, including Carolina and Elena for your son, and then for Sotero, that he might be especially protected and sustained while awaiting an opportunity for your parents to be able to visit you. And for all the other needs that are known to God alone, those who perhaps are most in need of God's grace and who have no one to pray for them. Our Lady of Guadalupe, Pray for us. Eternal Father, I offer you the most precious body and blood, soul and divinity of your divine Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, in union with all the holy masses which are said throughout the world, for all the holy souls in purgatory, for sinners everywhere, for sinners in the universal church, those in my own home and within my own family. Amen.
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Ghost, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Punctius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Ghost, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The first glorious mystery, the resurrection of our Lord from the dead. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, an increase of faith, and especially for those who are suffering tremendously in the wake of tragedy, that they might have particular graces of faith in our divine Savior. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, 
and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. The second glorious mystery, the ascension of our Lord into heaven, we ask for the fruit of the mystery, hope. And we pray especially for hope for all the families who are grieving right now from the sudden loss of children. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. The third glorious mystery, the descent of the Holy Ghost upon the apostles and the Blessed Virgin Mary. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, zeal for the salvation of souls. And we ask especially that all of us might have that zeal, realizing that we never know from one day to the next when our neighbor will be called from this world. And so we might make use of today to help their souls open to the truth that comes through Jesus Christ. Our 
our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. The fourth glorious mystery, the Assumption of Our Lady into Heaven. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, true devotion to Mary, and especially that all those suffering from tragedy might draw nearer to their Heavenly Mother. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thy mercy. The fifth glorious mystery, the crowning of Our Lady, Queen of Heaven and Earth. We ask for the fruit of the mystery, the grace of final perseverance. Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls to heaven, especially those most in need of thine mercy. O Jesus, I choose to live this day for love of thee, for the conversion of sinners, and in reparation for the sins committed against the Immaculate Heart of Mary. Amen. Regina Celi Laetare Alleluia Qui Aquem Merubisti Portare Alleluia Resurrexit Sicut Ixit Alleluia Ora pro nobis Deum Alleluia Gaudet letare virgo Maria, Alleluia. Quia surrexit Dominus fere, Alleluia. Oremus. Deus qui per resurrectionem firitui, Domini nostri Iesu Christi, munum letificare digna tu sens. Presta quesumus. Ut per eius centricem virginem Mariam perpetui capiamus gaudia vitae. Perium dem Christum Dominum Nostrum. Amen. And may Almighty God, through the intercession of the Immaculate Heart of the Blessed Virgin Mary, pour His graces upon each one of your families. Benedictio Dei Omnipotentis, Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti, Descendat super vos et maniat semper. Amen. And we'll continue now with the preparation according to the words of St. Louis de Mumford for the total consecration to Jesus through Mary. And we're nearing now the very end of the book. There's just a few days more of the preparation. And you'll see the final section. Uh, we're gonna, today is going to be the last part of the effects of the devotion. So some of what the wonderful graces that will be produced in the soul. But then tomorrow, in the final five days of preparation before the consecration, will be on the practice of the devotion. So the shortest section, but uh, in many ways the most important section of the whole book, we'll be going into. And so St. Louis de Mumford continues with the sixth effect of the devotion, the transformation of the faithful soul by Mary into the likeness of Jesus Christ. If Mary, who is the tree of life, is well cultivated in our soul by fidelity to the practices of this devotion, she will bear her fruit in her own time, and her fruit is none other than Jesus Christ. How many devout souls do I see who seek Jesus Christ? by some way or by one practice, and others by other ways and other practices, and oftentimes after they have toiled much throughout the night, they say, we have toiled all night and have taken nothing. We may say to them, you have labored much and gained little. Jesus is yet feeble in you, but by that immaculate way of Mary, and that divine practice which I am teaching, we toil during the day, we toil in a holy place, we toil but little. There is no night in Mary, because there is no sin nor even the slightest shade. Mary is a holy place, and the holy of holies where saints are formed and molded. Take notice, if you please, that I say the saints are molded in Mary, there is a great difference between making a figure in relief by blows of hammer and chisel and making a figure by throwing it into a mold. Statuaries and sculptors labor much to make figures in the first manner, but to make them in the second manner, they work little and do their work quickly. St. Augustine calls our Blessed Lady the mold of God, the mold fit to cast 
the mold, the mold gods. He who is cast in this mold is presently formed and molded in Jesus Christ. Sorry, the mold fit to cast and mold gods, meaning it was in Our Lady's womb that Jesus Christ was, was formed, was molded, you could say. He who is cast in this mold is presently formed and molded in Jesus Christ, and Jesus Christ in him. At a slight expense and in a short time, he will become God. That means be formed in the image of Jesus Christ, because he has been cast in the same mold which has formed a God. It seems to me that I can very aptly compare directors and devout persons who wish to form Jesus Christ in themselves or others by practices different from this one, to sculptors who trust in their own professional skill, ingenuity or art, and so give an infinity of hammerings and chiselings to a hard stone or a piece of badly polished wood to make an image of Jesus Christ out of it. Sometimes they do not succeed in giving anything like the natural expression of Jesus, either from having no knowledge or experience of the person of Jesus, or from some blow awkwardly given, which has spoiled the work. But those who embrace the secret of grace, which I am revealing to them, may rightly compare, I may rightly compare to founders and casters who have discovered the beautiful mold of Mary, where Jesus was naturally and divinely formed, and without trusting in their own skill, but only in the goodness of the mold, they cast themselves and lose themselves in Mary to become the faithful portraits of Jesus Christ. Oh, how beautiful and true comparison! But who will comprehend it? I desire that you may, my dear brother, but remember that we cast in a mold only what is melted and liquid, that is to say, you must destroy and melt down in yourself the old Adam to become the new one in Mary. The seventh effect for the greater glory of God. By this practice, faithfully observed, you will give Jesus more glory in a month than by any other practice, however difficult, in many years. And I give the following reasons for it. First, because doing your actions by our Blessed Lady, as this practice teaches you, you abandon your own intentions and operations, although good and known, to lose yourself, so to speak, in the intentions of the Blessed Virgin, although they are unknown. Thus you enter by participation into the sublimity of her intentions, which are so pure that she gives more glory to God by the least of her actions, for example, in twirling her distaff or pointing her needle, then St. Lawrence by his cruel martyrdom on the gridiron, or even all the saints by all their heroic actions put together. It was thus that during her sojourn here below, she acquired such an unspeakable aggregate of graces and merits that it were easier to count the stars of the firmament, the drops of water in the sea, or the grains of sand upon its shore, than her merits and graces. Thus it was that she gave more glory to God than all the angels and saints have given him or ever will give him. A prodigy of Mary, O prodigy of Mary, thou canst not help but do prodigies of grace in souls that wish to lose themselves to get altogether in thee, because the soul in this practice counts as nothing whatever, as nothing whatever it thinks or does of itself, and puts its trust and takes its pleasures only in the dispositions of Mary, when it approaches Jesus or even speaks to him. Thus it practices humility far more than the souls who act of themselves and trust with however imperceptible a complacency in their own dispositions. But if the soul acts more humbly, it therefore more highly glorifies God, who is perfectly glorified only by the humble and those that are little and lowly in heart. Because our Blessed Lady being pleased out of great charity to receive the present of our actions in her virginal hands gives them an admirable beauty and splendor. Moreover, she offers them herself to Jesus Christ 
and it is evident that our Lord is thus more glorified by them than if we were offered them by our own criminal hands, than if we offered them by our own criminal hands. Lastly, because you never think of Mary without Mary's thinking of God for you, you never praise or honor Mary without Mary's praising and honoring God with you. Mary is altogether relative to God, and indeed, I might well call her the relation of God. She only exists with reference to God. She is the echo of God that says nothing, repeats nothing but God. If you say Mary, she says God. St. Elizabeth praised Mary and called her blessed because she had believed. Mary, the faithful echo of God, at once intoned, My soul doth magnify the Lord. That which Mary did then, she does daily now. When we praise her, love her, honor her, or give anything to her, it is God who is praised, God who is loved, God who is glorified. And it is God to God that we give through Mary and in Mary. And so we'll begin tomorrow, the very final section, very brief section, but the most important section, talking about how to live this devotion. But as St. Louis de Mumford says, it's comparable to a sculptor to make a good image of Jesus Christ. It takes great skill, lots of patience, and if you make a mistake with your hammer and chisel, you can spoil the whole work. Uh, it takes a lot of time and skill. But a mold, that is, if you melt down liquid metal and you pour it into a mold and then it cools, you have in a very short time, even someone who's very, rather unskilled can make a perfect image of Jesus Christ. And that, he says, is this devotion. And so let us ask in these prayers the, the Holy Ghost to teach us to enter into the heart of this devotion. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Father, all-powerful, have mercy on us. Jesus, eternal Son of the Father, Redeemer of the world, save us. Spirit of the Father and the Son, boundless life of both, sanctify us. Holy Trinity, hear us. Holy Ghost, who proceed us from the Father and the Son, enter our hearts. Holy Ghost, who art equal to the Father and the Son, enter our hearts. Promise of God the Father, have mercy on us. Ray of heavenly light, have mercy on us. Author of all good, have mercy on us. Source of heavenly water, have mercy on us. Consuming fire, have mercy on us. Ardent charity, have mercy on us. Spiritual unction, have mercy on us. Spirit of love and truth, have mercy on us. Spirit of wisdom and understanding, have mercy on us. Spirit of counsel and fortitude, have mercy on us. Spirit of knowledge and piety, have mercy on us. Spirit of the fear of the Lord, have mercy on us. Spirit of grace and prayer, have mercy on us. Spirit of peace and meekness, have mercy on us. Spirit of modesty and innocence, have mercy on us. Holy Ghost the Comforter, have mercy on us. Holy Ghost the Sanctifier, have mercy on us. Holy Ghost who governeth the Church, have mercy on us. Gift of God the Most High, have mercy on us. Spirit who fillest the universe, have mercy on us. Spirit of the adoption of the children of God, have mercy on us. Holy Ghost, inspire us with horror of sin. Holy Ghost, come and renew the face of the earth. Holy Ghost, shed thy light in our souls. Holy Ghost, engrave thy law in our hearts. Holy Ghost, inflame us with the flame of thy love. Holy Ghost, open to us the treasures of thy graces. Holy Ghost, teach us to pray well. Holy Ghost, enlighten us with thy heavenly inspirations. Holy Ghost, lead us in the way of salvation. Holy Ghost, grant us the only necessary knowledge. Holy Ghost, inspire in us the practice of good. Holy Ghost, grant us the merits of all virtues. Holy Ghost, make us persevere in justice. Holy Ghost, be thou our everlasting reward. Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, send us thy Holy Ghost. 
Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, pour down into our souls the gifts of the Holy Ghost. Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, grant us the spirit of wisdom and piety. Come, Holy Ghost, fill the hearts of thy faithful, and enkindle in them the fire of thy love. Let us pray. Grant, O merciful Father, that thy divine spirit may enlighten, inflame, and purify us, that he may penetrate us with his heavenly dew, and make us fruitful in good works. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, thy Son, who with thee in the unity of the same Spirit liveth and reigneth forever and ever. Amen. Hail, O star of the ocean, God's own mother blessed, ever sinless virgin, gate of heavenly rest, taking that sweet Ave which from Gabriel came, peace confirm within us, changing Eve's name. Break the sinner's fetters, make our blindness day, Chase all evils from us, for all blessings pray. Show thyself a mother, may the word divine, born for us thine infant, hear our prayers through thine. Virgin all excelling, mildest of the mild, free from guilt preserve us, meek and undefiled. Keep our life all spotless, make our way secure, till we find in Jesus joy forevermore. Praise to God the Father, honor to the Son, in the Holy Ghost, be the glory one. Amen. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Jesus, hear us. Jesus, graciously hear us. God, the Father of heaven, have mercy on us. God, the Son, Redeemer of the world, have mercy on us. God, the Holy Ghost, have mercy on us. Holy Trinity, one God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of the living God, have mercy on us. Jesus, splendor of the Father, have mercy on us. Jesus, brightness of eternal light, have mercy on us. Jesus, King of glory, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of justice, have mercy on us. Jesus, Son of the Virgin Mary, have mercy on us. Jesus, most amiable, have mercy on us. Jesus, most admirable, have mercy on us. Jesus, mighty God, have mercy on us. Jesus, Father of the world to come, have mercy on us. Jesus, angel of great counsel, have mercy on us. Jesus, most powerful, have mercy on us. Jesus, most patient, have mercy on us. Jesus, most obedient, have mercy on us. Jesus, meek and humble, have mercy on us. Jesus, lover of chastity, have mercy on us. Jesus, lover of us, have mercy on us. Jesus, God of peace, have mercy on us. Jesus, author of life, have mercy on us. Jesus, model of virtues, have mercy on us. Jesus, lover of souls, have mercy on us. Jesus, our God, have mercy on us. Jesus, our refuge, have mercy on us. Jesus, Father of the poor, have mercy on us. Jesus, treasure of the faithful, have mercy on us. Jesus, good shepherd, have mercy on us. Jesus, true light, have mercy on us. Jesus, eternal wisdom, have mercy on us. Jesus, infinite goodness, have mercy on us. Jesus, our way in our life, have mercy on us. Jesus, joy of angels, have mercy on us. Jesus, King of Patriarchs, have mercy on us. Jesus, Master of Apostles, have mercy on us. Jesus, Teacher of Evangelists, have mercy on us. Jesus, Strength of Martyrs, have mercy on us. Jesus, Light of Confessors, have mercy on us. Jesus, Purity of Virgins, have mercy on us. Jesus, Crown of All Saints, have mercy on us. Be merciful, Spare us, O Jesus. Be merciful, graciously hear us, O Jesus. From all evil, Jesus, deliver us. From all sin, Jesus, deliver us. From thy wrath, Jesus, deliver us. From the snares of the devil, Jesus, deliver us. From the spirit of fornication, Jesus, deliver us. From everlasting death, Jesus, deliver us. 
from the neglect of thine inspirations, Jesus, deliver us. Through the mystery of thy incarnation, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy nativity, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy infancy, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy most divine life, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy labors, Jesus, deliver us. Through thine agony and passion, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy cross and de dereliction, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy sufferings, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy death and burial, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy resurrection, Jesus, deliver us. Through thine ascension, Jesus, deliver us. Through thine institution of the Most Holy Eucharist, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy joys, Jesus, deliver us. Through thy glory, Jesus, deliver us. Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, spare us, O Jesus. Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Jesus. Lamb of God, who takest away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Jesus, hear us. Jesus, graciously hear us. Let us pray. O Lord Jesus Christ, who has said, Ask, and ye shall receive. Seek, and ye shall find. Knock, and it shall be opened unto you. Grant, we beseech thee, to us who ask the gift of thy divine love, that we may ever love thee with all our hearts, and in all our words and actions, and never cease from praising thee. Give us, O Lord, a perpetual fear and love of thy holy name, for thou never failest to govern those who thou dost solidly establish in thy love, who livest and reignest, world without end. Amen. O most loving Jesus, deign to let me pour forth my gratitude before thee, for the grace thou hast bestowed upon me in giving me to thy holy mother through the devotion of holy bondage, that she may be my advocate in the presence of thy majesty, and my support in my extreme misery. Alas, O Lord, I am so wretched that without this dear mother I should be certainly lost. Yes, Mary is necessary for me at thy side and everywhere, that she may appease thy just wrath, because I have so often offended thee, that she may save me from the eternal punishment of thy justice, which I deserve, that she may contemplate thee, speak to thee, pray to thee, approach thee and please thee, that she may help me to save my soul and the souls of others. In short, Mary is necessary for me, that I may always do thy holy will and seek thy greater glory in all things. Ah, would that I could proclaim throughout the whole world the mercy that thou hast shown to me. Would that everyone might know I should be already damned were it not for Mary. Would that I might offer worthy thanksgiving for so great a blessing. Mary is in me. Oh, what a treasure. Oh, what a consolation. And shall I not be entirely hers? Oh, what ingratitude. My dear Savior, send me death rather than such a calamity. For I would rather die than live without belonging entirely to Mary. With St. John the Evangelist at the foot of the cross, I have taken her a thousand times for my own, and as many times have I given myself to her. But if I have not yet done it as thou, dear Jesus, dost wish, I now renew this offering as thou dost desire me to renew it. And if thou seest in my soul or my body anything that does not belong to this august princess, I pray thee to take it and cast it far from me. For whatever in me does not belong to Mary is unworthy of thee. O Holy Ghost, grant me all these graces. Plant in my soul the tree of true life, which is Mary. Cultivate it and tend it so that it may grow and blossom and bring forth the fruit of life in abundance. O Holy Ghost, give me great devotion to Mary, thy faithful spouse. Give me great confidence in her maternal heart and an abiding refuge in her mercy, so that by her thou mayest truly form in me Jesus Christ, great and mighty, unto the fullness of his perfect age. Amen. 
O Jesus, living in Mary, come and live in thy servants, in the spirit of thy holiness, in the fullness of thy might, in the truth of thy virtues, in the perfection of thy ways, in the communion of thy mysteries. Subdue every hostile power in thy spirit for the glory of the Father. Amen.